This feels good. We need another one. <laughs> um, Dominic, uh, just tell me about those fourth quarter drives. You guys put two, two 90 plus yard drives together. Uh, what was the key behind those? Honestly, coach just came to us right before we walked out and he was just like, look, this this is you guys. This is your guys' moment. Look at the score. He just kept telling us, look at the scoreboard. And, you know, that's all it was for me, was just making sure I managed the game. Um, when, you, when you guys recovered the onside kick, what, what was your mindset? I told the president, you can ask him, I said, we're going to recover this. We did it all we can practice. We, we practice. That's what we practice. We do more special teams than offense. So sometimes, you know, when it's coming to those moments, you know, we're we, we going to be ready. Uh, uh, what was your reaction when Chris scored that go-ahead touchdown? I just did I not? I said, man, check down. Check they, down. We ran drive like two plays before that, and they, they just chased our drive. And I'm like, Chris, if you check down, we score. I'm gonna scramble right. Just go with me. Uh -huh. yep. And it, it worked out just like that. I was just, <laughs> it's a blessing. I seen your eyes look dead at me when you threw that <laughs> ball. So it was just fun. Just, uh, you know, what adjustments throughout the game did you guys have to make uh, offensively? Honestly, it's just keep doing our job. You know, we had so many penalties in the first half. Like that game really could have been bus wide open. You know, but we, we hurt ourselves with penalties. And, you know, we just tried to make sure we play mistake free football in the uh, Has this changed your season going forward? Oh, it's, it, it's huge. We're back in it. You know, I was number three team in the country. They were top in our conference. You know, I just opened things up, you know, to, for a three-way tie late in the end of the season. So we just got to finish these 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 games strong. Uh, Chris, huge day for you. Four touchdowns. Uh, what, nice. what, was, what was the key for you today? Just keep running hard. Just keep running hard? Yeah, Coach, coach Camp was also my running back coach. He was just telling me, you know, these guys very – very fundamentally sound, and you know that you know they they stick to their gaps and everything. So it was just downhill, 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 and that's that's what I did today. And it, it busted. Uh, throughout the week, did, you, did they say you were going to have a heavy workload today? Or? Oh, he said it's going to be tough sledding, and it sure was. Uh -huh. But I got mine. Uh, tell, tell me about those fourth quarter drives. Oh. <sighs> Quarterback, <laughs> receivers, <laughs> just just catching the ball, you know, picking them off, picking them off, picking them off, deep ball. It was it was perfect. It was it was it was a good thing to see from my perspective. Blocking, you know, helping out the line. It was it was a good thing. I, I liked it. Fourth quarter, it came down a couple fourth down, a couple fourth down plays. We converted. Big 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 momentum switch, man. I like that. Uh, how, how concerned were you with, with the clock? Because um, two, two drives took a lot of time. Not at all. I, I felt like we managed it very well. It was 12 seconds left when we gave him the ball. Uh, our offense did. We did a good job. We we scored twice in a row, you know. So we did a good job with the four minute clock that we had in the fourth quarter. Uh, how did it feel to score that that game winning touchdown? Felt good. Felt real good, you know. <laughs> <laughs> he told me I was gonna score it. He told me to check down it. It worked out. <laughs> now we sitting here. Uh huh. Ah, uh, defensive guys, how does it feel to upset the number three team? Oh man, it feels great. It feels great. Um. What, what adjustments did you guys have to make on the defensive side of the ball throughout the game? Honestly, it was going back to the basics. Uh, uh, it was just doing our job because we were really beating ourselves. Uh, you see the, the one one drive that we had in fourth and short, and, and we didn't get, in, didn't get in the right gaps. Next drive, we had 45 yards and penalties. So I, I, it just it just hurts us. So at halftime, he, he told us we're, we're our worst opponent, and we just started playing together and being committed, and it worked out. Um, you guys are down 31-14 heading to the fourth quarter. Um, what is what you guys? Have, what was the key to just to holding them scoreless? We just had to bow up. We just had to do our thing. We had to tackle. We knew Kara College was going to run the ball. They run the ball on everybody. But you know, we, like Mag said, we just killed ourselves with penalties, not getting off the field in third down. So once we got that fixed, we played really well. Our D line did great. They set the edges on them all day. DBs locked down the receivers, and it was just clear for the linebackers all day. Um, standing on the sideline and watching the offense move the ball down the field in the fourth quarter, what was that like? Oh, not a better feeling. Oh, man. <laughs> These guys, you saw it all week, man. They worked hard. They worked They worked their butts off all week, and it's great to see them put up the points against, I think it was the number one defense in the country. Mm -hmm. And, man, it's the sky's the limit for those guys when they execute the way they should. What's this guy do for you guys going forward? Is it motivation getting back He's got to get ready field? for Western. Uh -huh. Western's, I think they're – 4-0 or 3-0 oh going into the game. I don't know how they did, but, you know, they're a ranked team. Frontier Conference is tough. Every game's hard. you got to bring it every week.